What's good? It's your girl, Drop Top Charlie, you tuned to Floyd Up TV. Hey, go ahead and pull up a glass of whatever you're drinking with your girl. I know you've seen the title, and if you didn't, it don't matter. Jump right into it. Did everything go to Just gotta make sure. What's good? It's your girl. It did. So, today, what we're going to be doing real quickly is we're going to be doing a review on the Isha Lace Print Glue versus the Got to Be Glued Blasting Freeze Spray. I have to tell y'all the, the pros and cons because of the fact that there was some cons. So, I had to change my shirt because I had on a white shirt earlier with some symbols and things wasn't looking real good when you got on makeup. So, uh, where I'll show y'all uh, what y'all need to definitely not do when you put on makeup. <laughs> um, Let's get into this thing because this is real. This really irked my nerves. So... The Isha, the Isha glue. This is the luxury absolute. I hope you can see it. I'm gonna hold it there. Hopefully, it gets in focus because you need to see this. This I ordered two. These are the travel sizes, which are extremely small. But you know, if you got you know, go somewhere and you're just trying to do something quick, I guess you can order these. But this is my second one. I have not opened it and I will not open it. I don't want to open it. I will not open it. Here it is. Can you see it? Now, let's get into some real things because I'm just going to be very, very brief and quick about this review on this Isha luxury wig fashion. First of all, when I went to Atlanta for my birthday, I wanted to be cute. I was trying to do some things there and um, I wanted to be cute. So I purchased this glue because I seen that, you know, the reviews on the glue seems to be okay. As far as like holding and drying fast, no resolution stuff, uh, residue, sorry, no residue, like the aftermath of it, like it was just good reviews. So I decided to order it. I ordered it off Amazon and I paid about 15 to $16 for these two little things right here. You see what I'm saying? I was like, you know, I didn't think it was going to be this small, but they were, I paid about $16 on Amazon for these two little things. First of all, I'll tell you the the pros of it before we get into the bull. Pros of it is it does hold your lace front on. It does. It holds your lace front on and it dries quickly. Let's get into the cons. Notice there was only two pros about it. So, the cons are going to be heavily the fact, the, 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 the material of the product itself, it puts you in the mind of the glue that you use to glue stuff on papers and stuff when you um, were in middle school or elementary or element, you know, preschool, something of that nature. It's definitely... It is whitish. I would. Can we squeeze it out? Let's squeeze it out. Can you can you see that? Can you see that? Oh, look at that! It's completely white, just like the glue that you would use if you were gluing some paper to a wall. So it definitely was like. It didn't feel good on the hands. It didn't feel good on the hands. It didn't feel good on the skin of the scalp. It was definitely just retarded. I just, this product was 
not the best of feeling that in, in that area. Now, when I put it on my head, when I, I first you test it on your hand a little bit, you're like, Dad, this feel like that glue from school. And then it don't get sticky right away. So you're like, okay, well, I see these good reviews. So let me continue on, right? I put it on my head, and I'm like, okay, I got it on my head, and I'm like, okay, it's drying quickly, like literally. I told y'all there were pros and cons of this. The pros is that it dries quickly, but that can be bittersweet because if it's drying quickly and you don't know that it's going to dry that quickly, you might, you now you got to put another layer on and all this extra stuff, so you really got to be cautious of that. They need to like put that on the on the on the package or something. But I was smart enough to pay attention, so I was able to get it on my head. When I got it on my head, I noticed that I wasn't able to take it right back off, which is a problem for me, being somebody who I'm natural. So I just want to be cute for a few minutes or a few seconds, or you know, like I I just want to do this for a moment. I'm not really trying to wear a wig for a week or two weeks. <laughs> I mean, shout out to the ladies who wear it for two, three weeks, four weeks. You know, the ladies. Is, <laughs> but I got to breathe my, I got to feel my scalp. So I was not, I was like, how do I get this out of my head? And I, I knew that if I would have pulled it, I would have pulled my, my skin. So I said, you know what? Let me try to shampoo it off. It did not work. Um, so I had to move on through that and say, you know what, girl, wait till you get home. Because I was still in the A. Remember, I told you to get for the A right. So, ma'am, I came back home. Noticed that it was a little bit looser when I used conditioner versus shampoo. So, ladies, word of advice, when you're trying to get it off, make sure you're trying to use it with conditioner and not shampoo. You feel me? I tried to use both, but I used shampoo first. But I noticed when I came back home and did it with the shampoo, the conditioner, it definitely did diff it did a different outcome. But it could have been because I had waited a couple of days. I don't know. The glue was just extremely just like 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 glue. It was like glue. Like bro, this is still something that's still going on our head. We don't want nothing that's gonna pull our 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 skin off. So it's not cool. But anyway. Get home, was able to get it off, right? That's a bless. So I had the wig on for a total of two and a half, well, three, three and a half days, which is not how long I wanted to have this wig on. <laughs> so when I get the wig off, I'm like, okay, well, my normal procedure, because shout out to got to be glue free spray and it was a it was a um it was a youtube channel a, a dark skin chocolate girl oh she was beautiful but she did like a blonde wig and i ain't like that but anyway she showed the 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 necessary of using just this and not this plus the glue i guess so I, when I first got introduced to lace fronts, I was a, I was a female who was like, I want to do it, but I don't want to keep it on forever. So I was, I immediately went and did research on what could I do just to slap it on for a day and keep it secure for that day and get on through. And so this is what I came up with, right? I'll tell you the pros and cons of this too. But right now we on this Isha, which you should. You should buy if you want to wear. Look, I'm gonna tell you the pros and cons of why you should buy it and why you shouldn't. But anyway, what what sounds pop? So I'm like, well, you know, let me wash the glue out of the wig, right? You know, like when you take the wig off, finally, you want to wash the wig, make sure it's straight. And you want to get the glue off, right? These are the cons. It leaves white residue on your wig. And 
What I'm going to do is, because I probably, I, I'm sorry y'all I'm doing a live video, but right now I cannot put a, um, uh, I don't, I, I'm going to be able to, I can't right now, but I will be able to later. I'll be able to insert pictures, but right now I can't do that. I will make a thumbnail of the outer layer of my lace front wig when I took the wig off the white residue that it, that it left. Y'all. When I tell y'all, it made me feel like, okay, this is that glue that I was saying. This is that residue that I was saying. For the price that I paid for this, I should have been able to pay $10 for two of these. I paid seven, darn, 16 15 $16 for both of them. I should have been able to pay $8.99 for both. That's not my, that's him, that's neither here nor there. All I'm saying is they got me messed up because of the way that they, do you know the struggles that I had to go through to get the wig glue off of the lace once I took the wig off? And I noticed that all of the reviews that I went to to go watch to see if they put the wig on, they did the review on putting the wig on, but they never did a review on taking that wig off. It's a lot of residue left afterwards. So Isha Glue, compared to this, I will continue to use this. This is what I have on my lace front right now. And I have to also include that, ladies, if you are those ladies who like to wear the lace fronts all day for 27 days of the month, Hey, you might got to get something stronger than this. This is this is for people who want to be cute for, for, for a few moments. We ain't trying to do all that extra stuff for 27 days. I mean, it's really some females out here who sleep in their lace fronts. No, no shade to them. All tea on whatever they scab look like. But, child, I don't judge. It's been times where I had to sleep in my wig, too. But you best believe. On the strength of me having to glue it on my head, no, I don't. Let me, how can I take it off? That was my first question, how can I take it off? So, that's my review on the Isha. If I got to go between Isha versus got to be, on a daily basis, I'm using got to be. I'm going to tell you the, the cons of got to be. If you don't use it on a daily basis, like every single day, the type of material that it puts me in the mind of is like spritz. Like spritz spray, but stickier. So it's going to stick the lace down, but it's going to also clog up the spray nozzle. So, ladies, a secret behind what you do if your got to be glue is still a lot of it, but see, that's that water I had to put on. I'm going to tell y'all a secret. If it's a lot of got to be glue still in your thing and you haven't used it in a while, but you want to be cute and you notice that it's not spraying out or it's spraying out crazy, you have to you have to run hot water on it. You have to run hot water on it and let it sit for like five minutes, maybe three three to five minutes, so that it can melt the stickiness that is holding the wig down. So that it can spray out because it gets very sticky if you don't use it. And guess what? It'll clog up the nozzle that you're spraying out of. That's the only con to this. The only one. Other than that, bro, if you got, if you can put that thing on the hot water, bam, 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 you good. No, no, no shade, no tea, no shade. This right here. I would not recommend this for a natural female who likes to wear her natural hair and is trying to just throw on a wig for a day. I recommend this for females who are trying to wear a wig for a week. Don't care about leaving residue on the lace because you got money to buy other lace fronts weekly. Not to mention, shout out to it's uh, what are, AliExpress. That's why I say it's in. Express. No, I got this wig from AliExpress, and these they are not sponsoring me. Child, I ain't even got a, a, a thousand subscribers. But I got this wig 
And this ain't the wig that I I had to put this this child. We'll talk about this. But that was my synthetic life. This right here is human hair life. This is Brazilian hair. But I'm gonna tell y'all, it's 180 density. Ladies, you do not have to have 180 density hair. Why? Because 180 density hair is so thick. You sh I should have got 130 or 150 density. Now, if you want this thick ass, this thick hairstyle, that's fine. But go to a 180. But I will not go back to 180. Um, so I just want to tell y'all that. That's what this is. I also have another wig. This is human hair like too, but y'all already see me in this wig. I did a review on this wig, and it's on my channel, so you have to go down. Come on, be a convertible, baby. Come on, subscribe and like, and, and come on, see what your girl talk about. Because, baby, I'm I'm down down south like a, like a, have you ever been to a southern person's house? And they made you some home homemade food, like some homemade biscuits and gravy or something. Child, I'm I'm telling you, I'm gonna give you all of that flavor. But anyway, this wig right here, this one, I it smelled like I did when I washed them. This right here is really this is human hair, but this 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 pattern is not like this pattern. I don't like this pattern. I will never buy this pattern again. This is the only time y'all gonna see me with this hair. But I'm I'm shouting out AliExpress because AliExpress gives you a I'm gonna have to tag them in the video. They give you a lot of feedback before you buy the hair. It's gonna be ladies on there who purchase the hair and drop the videos of the hair when they purchase it. You're gonna be able to know exactly what you're purchasing before you purchase it. I'm not getting sponsored by none of these people, but I'm letting you know. AliExpress is one of is is the people who I've been ordering these wigs from. So check them out. So child, I she been sitting since these. My birthday was December the third. She I watched her December the second, maybe the first. She been sitting. Look how good she looked, child. I really want to put her on and take this off. But I mean, you know, you know, yeah, you child these hairs. I'm telling you now, the synthetic life. We not gonna talk about this, but. And who is the name? When you go on AliExpress, it'll have different type of uh, people who you can go um, buy the hair from. But this one particular that I bought this week that I have on my head is from this box right here. And it is actually, I see, I see, and then it has see your beauty. And then it has AliExpress at the top. I don't know. Can, if you can see it, I don't know. But I'm trying to put y'all on game to what I got going on. They also had a little part, but I'm going to tell y'all, they ain't had no eyelashes. The, the short wig that I got right there, they came with eyelashes. What is that? Alias Fries. Is that, is that Kayla TV? Nicole TV? No. No, oh, okay. Child, I'm trying to be petty, but that was real cute. She did favor her. All right. Well, that's my review on if you should, you know, use the Isha glue <clears throat> or if you should definitely use the got to be. I'm not a female who wears wigs and sleeps in them. So I prefer to use got to be. But if you actually uh, <clears throat> like to sleep in your wigs or if you have like a lifestyle that requires you to like have to wear a style longer then this may be a glue for you but you have to be careful because if you are on a budget you will <laughs> you want okay so how did I get the white residue off I had to use 90% 91% alcohol plus like two different types of scrubbing rags which ultimately messed up the lace the lace um it hey hey chit chat got to be good i like because they wash off of water thank you and see that's what i'm saying the issue glue is not you have to use shampoo and conditioner but you won't to me it seemed like the conditioner worked better so for the amount of money that they're charging us for this I honestly feel like, come on, man. Y'all should have came up with a better formula to where these females do not have to 
uh, fight to get the residue off of the lace once they take the wig off the head. So, <clears throat> that was petty, <laughs> Kalanita. <laughs> <laughs> but listen, yeah, definitely check out Gots to Be. Gots to Be, if you are if you are a female who doesn't like to sleep in the wigs, this is going to be something good for you. If you are a female who likes to sleep in those wigs and you got money to where you don't care about getting that residue off, you can kind of take the wig off and try to redo it with the residue or just throw it away because you like bump it, I'm going to get a new one anyway next, next week, girl. Then that might the Isha might work for you, but child, I am on a budget. Okay. Alrighty. Nah. I'm not about to sit here and keep. I should be able to wash that 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 got I can wash got to be glue off the same day that I wear it. I don't have to scrub it off. I don't have to do all of that. And 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 I wanna correct myself and say got to be Got to be glued blasting freeze spray is what I'm using, not the got to be glue. I haven't used the got to be glue yet. So, I'll probably do another review on y'all. I mean, on the glue, you know, the glue, because I haven't used the glue yet. So, I don't know if it's going to leave residue or whatever. From the reviews that I've been seeing on YouTube already, it leaves residue. That was the purpose of me ordering the Isha glue. So, chat. Oh, Thank you, Joyce. Chit chat for stopping through. I appreciate that. Oh, I ain't, you know. I'm still new to this. But I ain't, but I'm true to this, you know, so. I'm about to, what I'm about to do, I definitely wanted to make sure that I was going to say this on camera. Because, you know, I like to sh uh, shout out and let people know, like, I rock with y'all. I might be, I might be sitting there watching y'all, but I'm definitely about to tap into Kat. What, what's her thing at? I'm definitely about to t tap into it. Cat baby, Tokyo finding love ASAP. What? My girl on that one too. Bump that Beyonce down for the reason why no couch. <laughs> Listen, I well I'm gonna tell you. I can honestly say that I've had a good experience with AliExpress. Isha Glue is, I won't be ordering from Isha Glue ever again. Gots to be, gots to be, what, I heard they got two different glues. I heard they got a black, a black glue and like a clear glue. I'm curious to know which one do what. I don't know if it's a gel or what. I don't know, but I'm going to do my, re I'm going to do my research on that. And then I'm definitely going to do a, a review video on that as well. But yeah. Let me get up out of here. I'm about to tap into Cat Baby. Uh, it's Cat Baby live or video. With, I want to see what's going on with Tokyo, honey. Cat be talking sometimes. She'll be like, Cat, quit talking, girl. Get to the dang video. But you know what? She got to do that. And it shows her personality and stuff and I, you know, it just shows who she is. So I'm definitely rooting for her. Make sure y'all check out her channel. Um, let me get up out of here though. Cause I, we sipping. See, that's why. See, that's what I'm saying, Kat. I had to save the rest of the bottle and pour it in, and I was like, okay, well, I take, I take the last little bit for Cat. Cat baby. Tokyo, Tony better be on point today, girl, because she had me mad as hell last week. Gonna send home, um, who she sent? She sent home the white dude, um, child, she sent home the white dude who gave her the information that, the, that, that Lyrica, Lyrica G, Lyrica G, and, um, that other dude was talking. I said, honey. She sent the wrong person home, didn't she? 
All right, let me get up out of here, y'all. Well, she can get into the baby hair life, but a bitch is blazing, you know, busy and lazy. I ain't got time for baby hair. I hope y'all have a good but day. Joy's chit chat. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Buzz. Mm -hmm. But anyway, man, that's what's the channel? Corey, where you at? You I'm know I'm looking for you. Drama. I want to laugh. Girl, look. Thank you. Thank you. Before I go, I will tell you where to go. Look, I'm about look. Her her channel is is Cat Baby. She she doesn't do no drama type stuff. She do like them. Um, well, I guess that is drama though. She do um, she doing Tokyo finding finding love ASAP. Girl, come on over and watch it with me, girl. I'm about to watch it right now. I'm only two minutes and forty one seconds in. Come on. Yeah! Ah! <laughs> so, it's about uh, fried some screw. Yeah! Sipping wine! See, you got me in the zone. Let me go. Come on over and watch the show, man. Come on over, y'all. Come on to It's Cat Baby page. She only got 8,000, 8.39k subscribers. She cool as hell. Little chocolate bone. She got the wine glass in the bottle. Come on over. Yes! But baby, hey, she got It's Cat Baby with three Y's. It's Cat Baby with three Y's. And it's all one word. All one word. All right, boo. Joy, I hope to see you over there in the, in the comments. Come on in the comments. She like us to comment. Come on over, chit chat, Joy. Joy, chit chat. All right, let me end this. I'll see y'all later. Come on over now. Love you guys. Bye-bye.